Hello and welcome to a series of videos about, in my opinion, the greatest game of all time, for the PC anyway, the cult classic Championship Manager Season 99-2000. Boom. Now this video is all about left backs, so if you're looking for a left sided fullback, you have come to the right place. Now I'm not going to spend my time or waste yours looking at the very best uh, left backs in the world because quite frankly you can find these yourself go to Real Madrid and you will find Roberto Carlos sat in the dressing room 26 years of age insane stats with probably a good five or six years left in him at top level a quick plane journey to Italy and you will find the man the legend Paolo Maldini 31 years of age and to his standards, probably got another 10 years left in him. Again, incredible stats. So yeah, you don't need me to find you the world's best left-backs. You probably, hopefully, need me to find you the world's best future left-backs. So you have to start somewhere, and I'm starting at West Ham United. Why West Ham? Because the Hammers are quite depleted in this area. Don't get me wrong, they've got the ledge Stewie Pearce, but he's 37, and he's just bust his leg. So he'll be out for at least 18 months. Uh, which probably spells retirement for him. I'm not sure if that happened in real life. Uh, please comment below. But I know he was a, a young manager, so probably did. But that would just leave you with Scott Minto as your solitary left back. And no disrespect, Scott Minto, but that is a worrying times. Worrying times if you've only got Scott Minto as your only choice for left back. So this video is perfect for strengthening that position. So first thing I do is I jump in the car. Head down to South Yorkshire, onto the M18, to Rotherham, where I speak to Ronnie Moore. I go, Ronnie, Paul Dillon, any chance? 20 years of age, Irish. Bearing in mind that attributes go to 20 maximum. He's already great in stamina and tackling. Good on strength. Other defensive attributes, acceleration, heading, jumping, pace, positioning, determination. They're all good. And with the right coaching, he will become an absolute legend of the game. £575 pound a week is his contract, which is decent for a left-back in Division 3 uh, in 1999. He's done well for himself there. Valued at £40,000. So £100,000 would definitely land Paul Dillon. If you don't have any competition for his signature, you could maybe get away with 65, 70, 75 grand maybe. Do not go into war with people for Paul Dillon's signature. Outbid them. Make sure you get him. He is that important. Now, Paul Dillon, I would play left-back. Uh, primarily but as always happens injuries and suspensions will happen so he could also do a job as left-sided centre half and with heading and jumping only likely to improve with good coaching I'm sure he'll get you a few goals as well okay now we go north of the border and Stephen Hamill okay remember it's a V not a PH it's a double M double L and an E not an A it's a nightmare to spell but if you spend your time and you spell it right it'll be worth it because 17 acceleration, 18 dribbling, 16 pace. This guy is a flair player on the left side of uh, defence and really worth spending the money. Only wanting 250 quid a week, so that's affordable. 95,000 value though, so out of the three players I'm going to mention, he's the least attainable financially. However, a quarter of a mil might get you in. Depends if Motherwell want to sell. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. So the best thing to do is to add him to your shortlist and monitor the situation but he's certainly worth the money and where i play him is sorry about that where i play him is left back maybe even left wing back playing him up there so he can use his pace but he will certainly get you assists and he will certainly be a consistent performer at left back last but not least gareth jellyman at peterborough welsh 20 determination 20 work rate influence of 13 he is a nailed-on Welsh captain if he gets enough game time and is coached properly. A quality operator at the left side of the fence can also operate as a defensive midfielder. £300 a week and very similar to Paul Dillon. You might need to bid under grand to make sure you 100% get him. If not, you could probably nick him for 60, 65, 70 grand. But I can assure you, Paul Dillon, Stephen Hamill and Gareth Jellyman will not let you down. Please like, comment and subscribe. Particularly if you're signing these players, please let me know how you've got on. Let me know any other left-backs you, you rate. I know there's Adam Eaton at Preston, who's another good left-back. 
There's also Ashley Ficklin and Steve Algerman. Scunthorpe can do a job. But these three, I can assure you, will not let you down. Please like, comment and subscribe and check in for more future videos. Thanks for watching.